All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Overlord Season 4, Episode 6. In the last episode, uh, Irons and Co. were heading off to the Dwarven Kingdom. They found the Old Kingdom. Uh, they found a dwarf named... God... What was his goddamn name? Something cool... Something beard. I don't know, I forgot his goddamn name, but I'll remember it because he seemed like a pretty cool character. Um, they got to know him, they got to know his reasoning as to why he was still there in the Old Kingdom. We knew that the dwarves have evacuated due to being you know, attacked by these fucked up creatures. Shaltier made quick work of them, but then found out that they were a big army of them heading on to the new Dwarven Kingdom. So now in this episode, we're going to try and head over to there, hopefully, to save them, um, stop them from getting slaughtered. Hopefully, make a cool Dwarven alliance, be very sweet. Adding to the Sorcerer Kingdom, Dwarves would be an awesome pick as well, especially with the kind of um, the, the magic weapons and what that they, they can make. Uh, seems very cool, very excited for it. So as always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Yeah, I think the soldiers would understand, probably. You gotta do what you gotta do. Fucking vaporize, dude. Easy work, let's go. Yeah, but they're gonna have something strong they'll be able to bust through this. Watch. Ha! <laughs> Ainz is just teleported here, obviously. It's got to be the weirdest shit. The, the the person that shows up is a freaking undead. And he's got an army behind him. Would you consider accepting my assistance? Wipes them out instantly. Congress often dances but does not progress. Oh boy. And if ain't that, if that ain't the truth. Look at the aura coming off him, bro. Holy shit. This is kind of fucked up because for all they know, Ainz could be behind this. I mean, he's not, but this could be just some elaborate plan. Look at them just bobbing up and down like Pokemon. Bro, they're about to get fucked up. What the hell is this? Oh, it's a Death Knight. Lol. Oh, there's multiple. I was really like, yeah, only one Death Knight is needed. What are those? Damn. Quick work. Giant dwarfs. Wouldn't that just be like a regular sized human? <laughs> Bro, these bridges are built to last. Eh, it's a couple death knights. Eins isn't going to sweat over it. Damn. Even falling to their death. Managed to take one out. That's crazy. Well, that was easy. Smart. <laughs> he was like, don't shut that door on me. <laughs> Is he really bothered about that, though? They fell. It's not that big of a deal. Yeah, no, they, they just fell. It's not, not that big of a deal. That was quick. Y'all work fast. Bro, this fucking, like, everywhere is just not built for Ainz's height. This is the Secretary General. Governor of Caves and Mines. Okay. <laughs> Liquor? You don't say. Oh, the Forge Master. What's he got to say? Yeah, is there only one entrance into this place, or...? Oh, you want to take him out with the soul signs, okay. Yeah, you know what? You know how Ainz is going to deal with this? Three death knights. And no bridges. <laughs> A dragon? Man can deal with dragons. 
I mean, it's a, a, he's right to be like, that I don't fucking trust this guy. All the runesmiths of your country to my own kingdom, I forgot he wants that. That's not enough of a benefit, yeah. I mean, they work on kind of magic items. They don't really work off rune technology anymore, do they? Or, like, not much, so... Hmm, grunt, grunt, grunt. <laughs> oh my god. He's evil, but he's lawful evil. I think. I feel like being an ally of Ainz would be really beneficial. Yeah, that's reasonable. Nice. Yeah, you want more people to come over. That's cool. Gomboy. He doesn't like alcohol. Wow, that's crazy for a dwarf. <laughs> Hello. Oh, are these all the runesmiths? <laughs> Did you just interrupt me, bitch? <laughs> yeah, but he has the resources to bring it back up. The Dwarven King's Hammer. Well, it seems there's a shitload of runes on that sword. Yeah, this is how you motivate them. Hell yeah. Like, he could have just taken them, you know, the kid, the council already agreed, but he had to mo motivate them like this. I like how this lizard dude's still hovering about. Like he's not really got anything to do. Oh, Well, Ainz hasn't. He's got your back, bro. Why is this hitting me so much? Oh, this is really sweet. I'd love it if Gondo was the one that was uh, that would be able to find the lost technology. That'd be sweet. Oh, is it Gondo? Yes, he's coming with. Let's go. Ah, he's going to steal from the royal capital. Nice. Yep, very true. If anybody should have it, he should. I like Gondo. I hope he, like, sticks around a lot. He hasn't figured out by now that they dropped the Death Knights. Bro, a fucking uh, little Dark Elf's gonna look down on the chairs and be like, Oh, there are the Death Knights. <laughs> Shh. <laughs> He's trying to tell you something here, bro. No, tell him. Go on. Ainz thinks this is going to be just slightly harder than it's actually going to be. And it's going to be a cakewalk. Yeah, it's not really a big deal, bro. Show them the power of Nazarick. I really want them to resist. Alright, so that was Overlord Season 4, Episode 6. Uh, that was a really freaking good episode. Uh, I'm excited to see now. Obviously, he made quick work. There's uh, the Kuro, 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 Kuro Goa. Um, and he's probably going to make quick work of them in here as well. There is a Frost Dragon, so that that could be something, but I still feel like he will deal with that easily. Um, yeah, very excited for this next episode. Really enjoyed this episode. I'm glad to see Gondo uh, is coming with too. He's a really cool character. I like that. And I, I really liked how, the, how uh, Ayn's motivated the dwarves as well. Yeah, overall a very good episode. Definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.